June 23rd, 2014, from the Arena das Vassara in Cartava, Brazil. It was the 2014 World Cup Brazil. And along with the other matchup of the day, at the same time as the Netherlands versus Chile was going on, we had Spain versus Australia in the other matchup out of Group B. Both of these teams had already been pretty much done and eliminated. Spain was eliminated, Australia was eliminated, they're gone. So this was a battle of futility. But they played it anyway, and so here we are covering it. Because it's soccer, it's the World Cup in Spain. Here's the story. If Spain, would they get a win after losing two games? First losing to the Netherlands, then losing to Chile. Now would they get a win against Australia? Because, you know, this way they could somewhat see some sort of respect out of the poor performance as they came into this tournament, the number one seed and the defending champions, and got knocked out in the group round. But here they were today trying to save some face against Australia, and that's what they did at the 36 minute mark with David Villa score the goal with a right foot and shot to the center of the goal. So Spain went up one to nothing over the Aussies. That would be it for the first half. Then in the second half, at the 69 minute mark, Fernando Torres scored a goal with a right foot and shot to the bottom right corner. So Spain went up two to nothing at this point. And just for good measure, at the 82nd mark, Juan Mata scored a goal with a left footed shot to the center of the goal. So Spain went up three to nothing at this point, and that would be the final score if Spain comes off with a dominant performance in this game. They went three to nothing. They had this game in control the whole way. They just destroyed Australia as they saved some face here by getting this win. Even though they're out the tournament, they get a big dominant win on their way out of Brazil as they're leaving. And in this game, they just dominated on shots on goal. Is Australia did not even get one shot on goal. They had zero shots on goal. It's the first game that's happened in this tournament where a team failed to even get one shot on goal. That's how dominant Spain's defense was in this game. They had eight shots on goal. As they were freely kicking the ball towards the net with ease throughout. They also dominated on corner kicks, six corner kicks to two. And on time possession was somewhat close. It was 55 to 45 in favor of Spain. But three to nothing, Spain gets the shutout. As Pepe did really good in goal. He gets the shutout for Spain. So they have something to hang their hat on as they leave Brazil with at least they got one win. Although they had a very poor performance and they're exiting this tournament with a disappointment for the fans in Spain. The number one team is gone. They're out the door, out the way, and at least they got a win on the way out. So, three to nothing Spain. Both Spain and Australia are out of this tournament. They're gone. Chile and the Netherlands move on out of Group B. And that's the early results. We got two more games coming in the very soon, they're about to start in the next hour, and that will be to see what happens in Group A. So lots of excitement in the World Cup here on June 23rd.